Well, if you needed more incentive to watch FC Cincinnati at TQL Stadium, we have it for you. Soccer fans headed to the match this season will see a brand new addition on the concession side. We're talking about AJ's Cheese Steaks. You've already got my attention. Food is the way to go. WLWT News finds Lacey Roberts caught up with the owner of the Cincinnati favorite to talk about this new opportunity. Lacey. Ashley, I'm right there with you. It's never a bad time to talk about food and these cheesesteaks will have you dreaming about them. Now, Ty Velez is the owner of AJ's Cheesesteaks, and he tells you that when he was asked to join the concessions here at TQL Stadium, at first he was in shock, but he says it was a no brainer for more reasons than one. Now, if you do not know, AJ's Cheesesteaks is a food truck located in a Norwood serving more than five types of cheesesteaks, wings, loaded fries and more. I'm telling you specialty sauces that you wouldn't even think of. Now he started this business more than five years ago starting in a 500 foot space while working three different jobs. But now he's in a 35 foot bus and open seven days a week. Ty was originally approached for the deal for FCC by their executive chef saying that staff regularly door dash the infamous cheesesteaks. And once he tried one for himself, he knew he'd be the perfect fit. Serving food at the opener was Velez's first soccer match. He says the fans did not disappoint. What I didn't know is that they turn up at that soccer stadium. That was my first time. Like, I didn't think, when I start seeing, like, even black dudes out there with shirts off yelling and screaming, I'm like, dang, this, these guys be having fun. <laughs> like, this is, it's really, really fun. Um, my adrenaline, that, it got my, that, that stadium, that rush, that amount of people, that, it just got me going. Now, he says also the support from the fans for him being inside the soccer stadium was a rush in and of itself and that he cannot wait until tomorrow's match. Lacey Roberts, WWT News 5. Now, Lacey, I saw these cheesesteaks on your social media, on Kelly Rippin's <laughs> social media. They look pretty good. I'm upset that I don't have one, but we heard you actually got to make one uh, yourself. How'd that go? Yes, I did. Now, first, Ashley, you know, we love food, so it was just an experience <laughs> in and of itself. But actually seeing the process of what goes into making the cheese take, the arm work, the leg, the leg work, it's a whole full body workout. But coming up the next hour, half hour, you'll get to see all the love and effort that goes into making those cheese steaks and why being at the stadium was a huge rush for him and his staff. All right, Lacey Roberts reporting live <laughs> for us on the food beat there at TQL Stadium. Thanks so much, Lacey. I